community friends and of course all other youtubers who are watching this video this is Ingrid from the Netherlands again aka Rocking Lupa last weekend uh, Saturday I went to the record fair in Utrecht the Netherlands and uh, I already told you about it in my previous videos and uh, so uh, yeah uh, it seems to be uh, they say that uh, it's the largest record fair in the world so um, yeah again I don't know if that's true but um, yeah that's uh, the, that's what they say so um, but uh, yeah uh, it's always uh, twice a year so you can go in uh, April and in November and it's all always an entire weekend uh, so you can go uh, a Saturday or Sunday or both uh, days but I just uh, chose to uh, go uh, uh, Saturday and um, yeah I think I picked up some very nice uh, stuff and uh, yeah uh, actually uh, as well uh, CDs and uh, vinyl and uh, yeah a lot of uh, bargain bins you know uh, uh, for example uh, CDs for only two or three, three uh, euros uh, a piece or uh, you know and um, yeah so uh, our uh, LPs for only five euros or less and um, yeah stuff like that so um, yeah I went there uh, with my son uh, he's 15 years old and uh, he always uh, likes to go uh, with me and uh, he also picked up some very nice uh, stuff you know like uh, t-shirts and and uh, you know stuff like that so um, yeah and um, I think it's uh, yeah I think it's nice to show you all the the stuff I just picked up uh, last Saturday and uh, because it's quite a lot uh, I wanted to show you uh, very fast uh, if possible and uh, I only have uh, yeah I don't have much time today because I, I always I also have to work uh, this afternoon and the evening so um, yeah um, let's start off very quick uh, with showing you the things I picked up on the record fair last Saturday okay well I start uh, with the CDs first um, let's see uh, I picked up uh, this CD by George Harrison in the material world so George Harrison um, I picked up uh, two CDs by the Black Rose. Uh, this is War Paint. I also picked up um, Americana. So two more uh, Black Rose CDs in my collection. So that's very cool. Uh, this is a uh, John Bon Jovi uh, CD I just didn't have. It's the Power Station years 1980 until 1983. So very nice addition to my Bon Jovi collection. Um, this is uh, Don't uh, Don't Treat or Don't Tread. I don't know how to uh, pronounce that. Uh, by the damn Yankees and um, this is um, the band Allergy and uh, the CD is called State of Mind and it's with the vocalist Ian uh, Perry and he once also was the vocalist for Vengeance uh, for a while so the Dutch uh, band Hard Rock Band Vengeance and uh, well this is a nice CD by John Farnham uh, then again uh, 
um, I also picked up some very cool uh, Foo Fighter CDs I just didn't have and I think they're all unofficial uh, releases uh, this is live in Rio 2001 so very cool to have um, this is um, Foo Fighters Man with a Golden Arm so also very cool stuff and uh, this is also Foo Fighters and uh, actually I don't know what it is but it's called No 100 so those are my Foo Fighters uh, pickups uh, this is a CD uh, by, the, uh, by uh, Deep Purple vocalist Ian Gillen and it's uh, called Dreamcatcher I played it yesterday and uh, to be honest it was not really what I expected uh, what it would be you know uh, so it was not really uh, rock music but as uh, yeah as I'm usually uh, as I'm used to uh, what he uh, yeah mostly sings if you know what I mean um, yeah, this is self-titled uh, this is the Lou Graham band so the previous foreigner singer Lou Graham so uh, yeah this was also in the bargain bin I think I only paid three euros for this um, I picked up also very nice uh, uh, yeah this is yeah this is from Josh Groban and it's called uh, Closer so very cool Uh, this is from Beth Hart, Leave the Light On. I think Beth, Beth Hart is a very uh, yeah, good rock, uh, bluesy uh, singer. Uh, this is uh, a CD by Janet Jackson. Also for 3 euros, so yeah, very cool to have. Uh, I also picked up some uh, Richard Marx uh, CDs, uh, which is very cool because uh, yeah, in the Netherlands I almost uh, yeah I just uh, it's very hard to, to get for some reason. So uh, I was very happy to find uh, some CDs. Yeah, this is self-titled. So Richard Marx, and uh, I also picked some other ones. Uh, this is Paid Vacation, also by Richard Marx. This is Rush Street. And so those were my Richard Marx uh, pickups. Uh, then I picked up some nice CDs by uh, Gary Moore. Rockin' Every Night, Live in Japan and this is uh, Live in Stockholm 1987 by Gary Moore uh, I picked up uh, Hey Man by Mr. Big so also very cool to have uh, this is uh, in bloom collection by Nirvana and I also think this is an unofficial uh, release but of course very nice to have um, David Lee Roth uh, Diamond Dave so the yeah uh, the frontman for uh, Van Halen the solo uh, CD uh, let's see, this was something I was looking for a while already uh, Greatest Hits, the Brian Setzer Orchestra So also very nice and you all know I'm such a big Brian Setzer yeah, a fan and collector also um, This is uh, something I just, uh, yeah, it was a surprise to, to find it 
Uh, this is, uh, I don't know if I pronounce it right, uh, Akira Kajijama <laughs> uh, with uh, Jolin Turner, of course the yeah, previous uh, yeah, Rainbow and Deep Purple uh, frontman and he also sang with uh, Ingwe Malmsteen and everything. And uh, this is Fire Without Flame. So uh, very nice that uh, I found this. And then the last CD I wanted to show you, I picked up. Uh, this is When You Were Mine by John Waite. And uh, yeah, of course he was uh, the frontman for the babies and uh, Bad English, uh, among others. So, John Waite. So uh, yeah, those were my uh, CDs I just picked up last Saturday. And, uh, but of course, I also picked up a lot of uh, very cool vinyl. And um, yeah, but I, uh, as I already said, uh, I don't have much time because I also have to work this afternoon. So I wanted to show you uh, very fast what I picked up last Saturday. Uh, the, la the very first I wanted to show you is Strength of Steel by Anvil. So very cool, and uh, yeah, it uh, yeah you don't see uh, Anvil records uh, these days uh, for some reason. So I was very happy uh, to find this. So uh, Anvil, uh, Stan Bush and the uh, Barrage, if I uh, pronounced it right, uh, it's self-titled, and. Um, among others, uh, the hit The Touch uh, is on this uh, LP, which you probably uh, also know from the uh, Transformers movie. So, And also um, the track Love Don't Lie, uh, which is written by Stan Bush, but uh, uh, also the band House of Lords, uh, they recorded that song uh, on an album. So uh, yeah, that's uh, very cool to have. Good condition also, Stan Bush, very cool uh, AOR music of course. Um, yeah, I found this one, New Jersey by Bon, uh, bon Jovi. I have another pressing also with a uh, different uh, yeah, back uh, cover, so uh, yeah, I was very ha happy to find this one. Bon Jovi, uh, another Cheap Trick uh, album. <laughs> Uh, the Doctor, so I didn't have this uh, one yet, so very nice uh, to uh, add it to my other Cheap Trick uh, LPs. Uh, this is wa was for only one uh, euro, uh, Now We May Begin by Randy Crawford. And uh, with among others the hit One Day I'll Fly Away, uh, which is very, uh, yeah, I think you know that song. So only for only one euro. Uh, Back for the attack by Dokken. I was not sure if I already had it, so uh, but it was only uh, two euro. Uh, euro so uh, yeah, I couldn't let this go. And uh, very uh, yeah, good condition also. Dokken. Uh, Ultra beat down by Dragon Force. And uh, yeah, good condition also. Uh, then I bought a few uh, records by a Dutch comedian, or um, yeah, I think he is one of our uh, most famous uh, comedians here. And um, yeah, his name is uh, Andre van Duin. <laughs> And uh, yeah, um, his career lasts for really already long, many many years. Uh, and uh, so um, yeah, it's always nice to pick up some uh, records or other stuff by by him. So uh, yeah, probably outside the Netherlands you never heard of of him. But uh, yeah, I just like to pick up some stuff uh, once in a while. So uh, this is uh, a release, André van Duin. 
and another uh, yeah this is also with other uh, comedians uh, from here in the Netherlands so uh, among others André van Duin, uh, The Mounties, uh, Johnny and Rijk uh, and other artists too so uh, yeah very cool uh, Dutch uh, comedian stuff uh, this is also André van Duin So very cool for my uh, André van Duin collection And uh, this is the last André van Duin uh, record I picked up uh, Saturday So uh, that's very cool uh, Then with the other stuff uh, This is the Electric Light Orchestra uh, Secret Messages um, I have a few ELO records but I didn't have this one yet so and it was only uh, 2 euro so uh, yeah not too expensive uh, out of this world Europe yeah of course uh, yeah it's very poppy hard rock but uh, yeah very well written songs and um, yeah it's just a great album for only 5 euro so Europe. Uh, then I picked up this one, uh, Lefty by Art Garfunkel, for only one euro. Uh, excellent condition. So uh, I was very happy uh, with this. Uh, this is Diamond Sun by Glass Tiger, and uh, yeah, I didn't uh, listen to it yet. So actually. I don't know what I can expect, but uh, it was uh, very cheap, and I think it's kind of uh, 80s hard rock kind of thing. So, uh, but again, I ha I'll have to check that out. <laughs> so, uh, Glass Tiger. Uh, this is Recovery Live by Great White, a great hard rock band. Uh, then I picked up uh, Musical Chairs by Sammy Hagar Of course the previous Van Halen frontman And uh, yeah, I didn't have this one yet so Yeah, very great to add this to my Sammy Hagar uh, LPs Because I already have a few other LPs by Sammy, Sammy Hagar Uh, then uh, this was also for, uh, both for one euro and uh, yeah he he was a very famous uh, yeah, folk uh, singer here in Holland and um, yeah he he comes from uh, uh, he came from Amsterdam and uh, unfortunately he uh, passed away already almost nine years ago but uh, yeah. Um, his his music is still very famous and people play play it a lot and uh, yeah he's still very popular you could say uh, th so these are bo both two LPs by the Dutch singer Andre Hazes so uh, they both were only uh, one euro so that's very cool uh, this is the self-titled uh, album by Heart. And it has, among others, uh, the hit Barracuda. So that's very uh, yeah, great to have. Uh, this is, uh, yeah, this was really a very nice surprise because I already have it on CD for m many years. And actually I didn't know it also was released on vinyl. So that's, uh, yeah, this was, this was a really cool find. It's self-titled, it's uh, from Heartland. In Heartland, uh, yeah, if you are really much into AOR music, I really recommend you, uh, yeah, to find this because it's really great AOR music. So, uh, Heartland. Uh, then I found some very cool stuff by, uh, yeah, a Dutch uh, hard rock band. And uh, this is Highway Chow. Uh, the uh, album is called uh, Storybook Heroes. So very great to find this. 
Uh, this is a 12 inch single by uh, Highway Chow. It's called Fever. And I also found this one. It's uh, Rockarama. Also by Highway Child. So uh, yeah, great Dutch uh, hard rock band. Uh, then I found the album Demons Down by House of Lords. And uh, yeah, this is so really great music. And uh, I already have it on a, a CD for many years. And I also have some vinyl, but... So it was very cool uh, to find this one, House of Lords. Um, Hurricane itself, uh, no it's not self-titled, it's called Over the Edge. Uh, yeah, this is also a very famous Dutch comedian uh, duo. Uh, they're called Johnny uh, and Rijk. Uh, but actually they're, they're Johnny Krijkamp and uh, Rijk de Gooyer. And uh, both, they uh, already passed away. So, uh, but it's very cool to have. So, uh, they were very uh, famous... Uh, yeah, uh, yeah, Dutch comedians. Uh, they were once were a duo, but they also have had a very successful career uh, separately. So, uh, yeah. So very cool to have. Uh, I found uh, two Crocus LPs. Uh, this one it's called Hardware. And I found this Crocus LP. The Blitz. Very great hard rock uh, music, of course. Uh, then uh, this was an LP I already wanted to have for a while. And this was uh, in the bargain bin also. So that's, uh, yeah, I was very happy uh, I found this. It's American Pie by Don McLean. So this was actually one of my uh, holy grails and uh, yeah, I'm glad uh, I found it uh, last Saturday. Uh, yeah, this is also uh, definitely one of my holy grails. It's the, the EP or mini LP by, uh, yeah, it's uh, uh, Garage Days re Revisited by Metallica. And um, yeah. I think I only pa paid uh, 12 euros for this, something like that, and uh, I already was looking for it for a while, but uh, on eBay, uh, yeah, mostly they ask about 20 euros or even more for it, for it. so um, yeah, and uh, so I'm glad I found it uh, uh, on, yeah, on the record fair yeah, last Saturday. Metallica. Uh, then I found this uh, very cool. Um, yeah, I th yeah, it's a two uh, two uh, LP set anthology by Gary Moore. So uh, yeah, really great. Um, this is uh, I, I also found this uh, I and I already showed you on CD, but I also found the vinyl uh, version. Uh, this is live in Japan. Gary Moore. And this is also very cool finds uh, live at the marquee. Gary Moore. And um, this is uh, Iron Age by Mother's Finest. Also, really great band. Uh, I found this one. Um, yes, it's self-titled. John Parr, with among others uh, Saint Elmo's Fire, the, um, which was of course from the uh, yeah the movie Saint Elmo's Fire. But uh, yeah, it's great AOR uh, music actually. So uh, yeah, 
actually I don't know um, what the rest of the album will be what uh, what it sounds like so that uh, yeah that would be uh, a surprise I, I guess so uh, but very nice uh, to find this in uh, such a good condition John Parr um, then I uh, found another LP by Poison and it's called Flesh and Blood so uh, yeah I didn't have this one yet so uh, yeah great addition to my other Poison LPs Uh, this is uh, Perfect Timing by Macaulay uh, Schenker Group, so uh, Robin Macaulay and um, Michael Schenker, of course. Yeah, great 80s uh, hard rock, melodic uh, rock AOR music, so uh, yeah, very cool find. Um, this is uh, Living in Oz by Rick Springfield. So uh, yeah, it's always very hard to find a Rick Springfield album, so, um, or at least in Holland. So uh, yeah, I was very happy to find this. Rick Springfield. Um, this is Invasion of Your Privacy by the band Red. Also great hard rock band. And um, yeah, it was mid-80s, 1985, so yeah, typical 80s hard rock, red. Um, this is uh, self-titled by The Storm. Also great melodic hard rock AOR music. So uh, yeah, great condition also. So uh, great, uh, great addition to my AOR uh, collection music. The Storm. Um, uh, yeah, I was so really happy to find this. Uh, it's Rescue You by the King of AOR, in my opinion. Uh, uh, besides uh, Steve Perry, of course, from uh, Journey. But yeah, he's such a great AOR singer. Uh, Jolyn Turner. And um, actually, I'm still looking for this uh, album in CD format, but uh, I ha didn't find it yet, so maybe, yeah, in the future, hopefully. But uh, very cool to have the vinyl already. Jolyn Turner. And the last find from last Saturday, it's uh, Going for the One by Yes. I already was looking for this album for a while, so uh, yeah, uh, triple uh, gatefold, as you can see, and uh, yeah, uh, cool to uh, finally have this. <laughs> so um, yes, well, um, I think uh, yeah, it's almost uh, 30 minutes now, so. Uh, yeah, <laughs> it's really a sort of miracle. I just uh, made it in uh, uh, to uh, show you all my stuff in about half an hour, you know. Um, but uh, yeah, I hope you liked it. And uh, please leave me comments, uh, you know, below the video or send me a personal message or contact me through Facebook or whatever. It's also very welcome. And uh, yeah, maybe you just visited the record fair too. And uh, yeah, uh, let me know uh, yeah what your experience were. Uh, you know, uh, did you find uh, some cool stuff too or whatever? So uh, yeah, that's uh, that would be very very nice uh, to know. So uh, well, um, I almost have to go uh, to my work. So I will upload this video later on uh, today. And um, but of course, uh, when I come home uh, later this evening, it would be al already too dark to just to just shoot a video. So I already recorded uh, this uh, by uh, uh, you know broad daylight. So uh, yeah. Um, well, uh, so those were my purchases from the record fair in Utrecht, 
and um, yeah I don't know if I will go again um, in November uh, you know it, it depends on uh, if I can afford it or not if you know what I mean so um, but uh, yeah it was a very nice day we enjoyed it very much and uh, yeah and uh, yeah I really picked up some very cool stuff uh, I think so well that that uh, was the, it for today and um, yeah hopefully I'll be back with another video for you okay thank you all for watching have a very nice w uh, yeah week and uh, yeah hopefully see you soon bye bye my friends see you soon